Hey guys, it's Anna slash Bum Bun from Passwom.com and I have a little tutorial on how to attach tags like the one I'm showing you here, like this one. How to attach it to squishies or any kind of, um, uh, I guess you could say cell phone charms. I guess you can do it with other things like strings or ribbons as well, um, but I'm going to be using this squishy right here. Um, so I include tags like these into every order. I don't have the time to attach them to every single squishy like I would like to do, so I just include them into each order. Um, I don't know how long that I'll continue to do it, um, because it does cost money to have the tags made, and it was a very awesome intended purpose, but because I don't have, a uh, unlimited stock of them, um, this is actually how much I have left here um so when this is gone um I don't know if I'll just continue to do them or not since I give them for each um amount of squishies that are not um licensed squishies I just give them for ones like these um the ones that are unlicensed or like Daiso brand or stuff like that um so basically I'm going to be showing you how to do it so let's get to that tutorial so basically what you're going to want to do is unclasp with the lobster clasp, unclasp it. That's why I have marks on my nails. Um, but you're going to unclasp it from the squishy. And then this here is what attaches your um, tag to the squishy. So it's no fancy things. It's just um, it goes through the loop. So you're pretty much putting it through see if I can do this on camera in the bestest way possible because I am working around my camera okay so you're putting the loop through your hole so you can do it you know with your own tags or whatever it's just the loop is through the hole and then you have this empty area here and then you put it through your lobster class is going through the loop and then you pull and it creates like this little knot thing and then you just take your lobster glass and just stick it back on your squishy that's it so now this one's going to be um, attached to this one so whoever gets it's going to have an automatic one attached because I'm not going to take it back off <laughs> um, but now you guys can do it yourself I include um, the tags into the orders um, for the time being like I said earlier um, or you can go ahead and make your own. It's really simple. Just take a hole punch and punch a hole. And these ones are shiny tags. Um, but you can do it with anything. Just like a piece of paper. Print it off on the computer. Punch a hole. Stick your um, cell phone strap through it. And it's really that simple. Um, so I'll see you all later. And thank you all for watching. I'm, I'm sorry if this is a little bit confusing. But I was asked by a couple people to show them how to do it. Um, and it's really hard to describe trying to say to put it through the loop. And they don't really know what loop. So instead of confusing you guys even more. And I still want to be very helpful. So I made this tutorial. So um, that's it. Don't forget to check out Passawoma.com. I'm still working real hard. Um, go check out all the banners and stuff. I did um, new banners on YouTube, the Facebook like page, um, Tumblr, I don't really care for the Tumblr, Tumblr one as much as I like all the other ones. Um, and what else did I put it on? Twitter. I put on the back of the Twitter, the background, and it's really cute. I like it. It's like a cloudy little star pastel thing. It's really cute. It has like 3D font. Um, it, it looks like if you wore 3D glasses that it would like jump out at you like it'd be 3D. I don't know because I didn't try. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below if you actually tried. Um, but I'll see you all later. Keep it super cute and crafty. And that's it. That's it. You know some dope shit.